Hello everybody, this is Bowsy Bowsy, and today we are back for another Minecraft tutorial. What we're building today is this little teapot. So let me go ahead and show you what you're going to need. There's not a lot to this build. You're going to need purple stained clay, white stained clay, a couple item frames, vines, rose bushes, and cobwebs. Now, the item frames, vines, rose bushes, and cobwebs are all up to you if you decide to add this into your world. It's just a couple little details that I thought would be pretty. So this is your base. You are going to need a three by three of white stained clay with three blocks on every side. Now we're just going to bring this out by one block on every side. And this is going to be your second layer. Just like that. So remove all those little edges. Now bring that up three blocks with the middle of it being your purple stained clay. Once you are done with that, go ahead and bring it in until you have that basic bottom shape again. Let's add in the lid, which is just a three by three with a block on the top. There you have your basic teapot shape. Now we need to add in the spout. So start off from where you'd like your spout. Up two, over one, and over one. There you have your spout. And let's move on to the handle. Coming back here, start one lower than the middle. And build up. And one more. Now join it up like this and two blocks that way. There is your handle. Now you have the finished teapot shape. Here is where you can add your decorations if you so choose. I placed uh, some rose bushes and vines like this on the sides. And the last little detail, if you'd like, are some cobwebs. So there is no secret to making the steam here. Basically, I just kind of go with a shape and take some blocks out as I, uh, when I go back through it, just like that. And there you have some steam coming from the teapot. Now there is one more addition you can add into this if you'd like. And let me show you what materials you'll need for a fountain. You will need some panes. Some white panes is what I chose for mine and make this little X shape right next to your spout. On the bottom where the water is going to go, make a hole and put your water bucket right there. The thing about the panes is that it's going to hold the water and make it go flow straight. If we didn't have the, have the panes, the water would overflow. So that's a little addition you can make to your teapot if you'd like add in a little water feature. If anyone has any suggestions on something to use other than the panes, I would be glad to hear it. Here is the finished teapot build. If you choose to add this into your world, please uh, post a comment down below with a picture to your teapot. I would love to see what you've created. Thank you again for watching. Have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next one. Bye.